shit. John, how do you feel, bud? I feel so happy. We got it. That's sweet. We got 20 pounds. <laughs> I don't know if this net's big enough, man. Off the shot. Oh, oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, here I go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, shit. Get yeah! oh, oh, oh my god! In this episode of Back and Boys, doing something a little different. Gonna do sort of a catch and cook. The unexpected burbot that we got in the last video. Uh, put a little clip of it right here. It's a cute little burbot. Or like 21 inch burbot. I have never caught a burbot. I've, there's never been a burbot caught on this boat. I'm gonna clean it and eat it. Never caught one of these things, so it also means I've never tasted one. I don't really like fish, which is kind of funny for someone who enjoys fishing so much. Uh, kokanee and uh, fresh salmon uh, are both the only fish that I enjoy eating. I'll eat pretty much anything, but those are the ones I actually enjoy. So uh, yeah, gonna try burbot. Everybody says it's freshwater lobster. We'll see if they're telling the truth. I can tell you right now that this thing is slimy. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that is gross. It is so smooth and slimy. Man, these are crazy looking fish. A little barbel there? Huh. Wild. Okay. I've, uh, I remember watching a video about peeling the skin off of these things like years ago. So maybe I'll start with that. But anyways, let's get this thing filleted. Um, probably make a horrible mess of it, but hey, I'll try. Let's get it going. Okay, we'll go uh, wash these up and uh, fry them up, I guess. Got my burbot head, my dirty that we got. <clears throat> for uh, sturgeon bait, so I'll go toss that in the freezer. Uh, you might have noticed this tray in the videos. This sits in the back of the boat. Uh, it's removable. It's got some feet on the bottom of it there that kind of locate it so it doesn't, uh, you know, fly around in the boat when it's wavy. But this thing is the best goddamn thing I ever did to the Kingfisher. It uh, is a great spot to put fish when you get them so you don't get slime all over your boat. Great spot to clean them once you're done put it on the tailgate of the truck and then you can just rinse it all out clean it all out it's uh if you don't have something like this in your boat i highly recommend it i think i'll just do a little bit of salt and pepper a little bit of butter just kind of fry them up in a pan i'll probably just cook this little tail section of this one to see if i like it and then um if i don't i can you know give them to somebody that does i know justin justin says that he likes it he's uh got bourbon in saskatchewan and shit like that so yeah, we'll just try a little piece, fry it up, salt, pepper, butter, and see how it tastes. I can definitely start to see why people are calling it freshwater lobster. The texture, the feel when it's raw is feeling like lobster. It's quite rubbery and firm uh, compared to trout and salmon. This is, yeah, quite a bit different feeling. Yeah, most people find it funny when I tell them that I don't generally like fish. I have yet to have any sort of white fish that I actually enjoy. Like uh, like fish and chips and stuff, I'll eat, but I'd never order it for myself. Um, fresh salmon, smoked salmon, smoked kokanee, stuff like that. That I can get down with, but uh, yeah, white fish. Maybe this will be the first white fish that I like. All right, fresh off the pan. Smothered in butter and salt and pepper. Oh, it's still hot. <coughs> Maybe I shouldn't use butter, because anything smothered in butter usually tastes pretty good. Okay, let's see what I think about this. It's a white fish. Yeah. It's a white fish, it's just a more firm 
more firm white fish than like cod and stuff like that. I can see why they call it freshwater lobster. It's just got kind of the same texture. If you like white fish, this is probably a good fish. If you don't like white fish, you're not gonna like this. Yeah, this is not for me. Kokanee salmon, that's my go-to. Not a white fish guy. All right, well, looks like I'm going to uh, vacuum bag the rest of that burbot. Justin, it's all yours. I am not a burbot guy. Huh. Yeah, I think I will uh, get the dog to help me out with this. She approves. <laughs>